Good evening, tubers. Doing a little straightening up out here. It's been a crazy spring, and this video really goes out to those of you who have been wondering, is he ever gonna build the greenhouse? Does he even really have one? Um, yeah, I have one. Uh, the first question is the one that <laughs> I'm actually wondering about, uh, just not getting a whole lot of time to get on it and build build it. But if you ever, ever wondered what it looks like um, before you put it together, this is it. Those are purlins. Those are the structure that hold, go in between the arches. There's 90 six foot of greenhouse in frame here um, that's the middle section it goes in between two of those this is going to be 30 by 96 uh, it is on four foot centers it's very very strong structure these are the end walls um, end wall pieces here and over there and those are the um, the track for uh, the wiggle wire that holds the actual uh, greenhouse film on. The stack over here, pardon me while I'm walking, this stack over here are the base. This will go down in the ground uh, a little better than four feet with about three feet of concrete. And those are support pieces from that come from the end walls down to the, uh, the the side arches all right that's that's the frame let me show you the rest of this monster okay this is new I forgot to show you this this is uh, one of two 40 foot shipping containers that is it's gonna go back there on that pad that area there that kind of level space I'm going to actually build a barn and a potting room out of those another project down the road but my barn collapsed there's a barn behind here I can show you that it's com it's completely shot uh, much like this and I'm replacing that and the barn this is going to um, uh, I'm gonna put two of these side by side with an eight foot space in the middle and I'm gonna build a structure and a uh, gabled structure over it and I'll be able to pull my tractor and everything, um, all my implements and toys in between there. Speaking of toys, my family's got a new toy. It's a 36 foot round pool. I still have yet to build the deck for it. It's gonna match up with the hot tub over there. You can see my addition I've put in. Uh, the things that have put this greenhouse off are that addition completely new kitchen with new floors cabinets counters new bathrooms with everything's new in the bathrooms um, I'm still putting uh, hardwood uh, throughout the rest of the house and I should be done with most of the projects in there for now uh, back to the greenhouse one last trip before we get to the greenhouse this was the old pool this is going to my daughter and my grandson. Uh, I've got to get it cleaned up and rolled up and over to them. Got Daniel out there cutting some grass, helping me out. Um, he's going to help me here in a few minutes roll this thing up so I can get it out of the way. So I can bring that other shipping container. Okay, it's going to be kind of hard to see this, but you can see all the Visqueen. I'm sorry, not Visqueen. Greenhouse film I have. Uh, that's both the end cap and uh, the... Two layers of poly over the entire structure and the side walls. Uh, the side walls will not roll up on this. This is uh, designed not to have ventilation come through the side uh, because, well, that's a 300,000 BTU gas heater to heat the whole thing. Let's see if you can see this stuff in here. It's kind of dark. These are shutters. These two big shutters will go on one side, and these two ginormous fans will go in the other, and it'll circulate the air throughout there. The, uh, now this is a, a door, a glass door, 
and I have two right here, two sliding glass doors uh, that I can drive the tractor through. And this is all the, those are the circulating fans that'll be hanging throughout. And this is the hardware and all the other stuff. So there you go. That's a greenhouse. Oh, there's some more, there's some more uh, purlin structure uh, that I started to put in here. So there you go. That's where we're at. Hopefully I can get this thing rolling here pretty soon. Uh, there are no videos on how to's for the Alaskan snow arch. So, sounds like he's running out of gas. Running out of gas. So anyway, I'll be doing a series of videos uh, for the Alaskan snow arch, the 30 by 96, and um, maybe they'll use that on their website so that people like me I don't have to try and figure this out on their own. God bless. Go play in some dirt. I'm getting that ready. I'm going to go ahead and till it probably this week and get ready to put some stuff in the garden. I'll grow something, even though I can't do it in the greenhouse. We'll see you next time. God bless.